Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I just made a video this morning about how to make this honeycomb shape inside this object, because it's not a phone anymore because of the cross. It engraved really good for the young lady. But one of my viewers, evidently a subscriber, because he's, he's helped me many times, uh, this time is a quick, neat trick, but in this scenario, I don't think it's going to work completely. But if you go to the your field and go to Interactive Field, and go right here to this two color pattern and click down and go to pulse field. You could go down to hexagon and then you can change the, the width and the frequency and we're gonna put it at two and we're gonna make the line width 10, 19, 20, whatever. That looks good and hit okay. Now you can take your outline pen tool and let's make it that and black and you basically have the same scenario with the exception that you can't fill in the individual squares or individual hexagons uh, and another thing I don't like and, and maybe uh, this gentleman who actually helped me figure it out also there's a white background I think it's actually a light gray background uh, because when you go to your interactive field tool, we need to get rid of the yellow background so I can click on our new field and go to interactive field tool and you go to edit it. It's saying this foreground is gray and you know you can change around with this and make it zero, but then you've got nothing. Or you could do just the opposite and make your background 100 and basically it makes it black and that to me is a problem it's not going to well one you can't do this pattern but two uh, in some scenarios it's white or it might actually be a little bit of a gray it's going to engrave a little bit and I will make a second video if I've got it if we, we maybe it will help me figure that out Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.